Hello everyone and welcome to Play With Me Toys for Kids. Remember the ice cream machine that I showed you from Frozen? The one that has Anna and Elsa on it? Well, today I'm gonna do my own ice cream and I'm gonna show you guys how I did it. It is super cool and it hopefully will turn out really delicious. So as I showed you in the previous video, the ice cream machine comes with a recipe book, but I want it to be original so I came up with my own ice cream recipe so I'm gonna show you how I did it so I'm gonna use cocoa milk chocolate some sour cream and here I have agar teen, which is the same thing as gelatin but the vegetarian option without gelatin but it's practically the same and I have salt of course, I have this blender that's going to help us mix all the ingredients together and a bowl. And of course, a spoon. And I'm also going to use these cups that come with the ice cream machine to measure. So let's get started. Here I have um, cocoa or chocolate. So I did a cup. And then I'm going to do just a little bit of our gelatin. So I'm going to open the bag and use a spoon to measure it because we don't need that much. We just need a little bit. There we go. And I'm going to mix it a little bit. I'm going to do one cup of milk. And then two cups of cream. There goes one. And two. And now I'm gonna blend it all together. And now it's all blended together and this looks like a paste kind of thing I, I bet is because of the gelatin and now let's see I'm gonna add a little bit of salt so that's just a tiny bit so I'm gonna measure it with my hand and I'm gonna put some of the chocolate pieces in it And then I blended it all together. So this mix is gonna go in the fridge for half an hour. I'm just gonna put it in. And this beaker, we're gonna put it in the freezer for half an hour, because we want it to be super cold. So the beaker goes in the freezer and the mix goes on the fridge, okay? So I'm gonna do that and check back in half an hour to get started with our ice cream. So freezer, fridge. So half an hour has passed and the beaker was in the freezer, the mix was on the fridge and this is how the mix looks. And in order to do this right, I'm gonna bring a friend, she's a special guest and she's gonna help me with everything. Uh, but first I'm gonna show you here I have some chocolate um, chips that we can sprinkle in. But anyway, let me go get my friend. Okay, so here we are and she's going to help me because I couldn't do it by myself. So I'm going to spin the wheel and what she's going to do is that she's going to help me pour the mix through the top and it's going to come down, hopefully as ice cream. So we're going to pour it from here from the back and I'm going to rotate the beaker and it's going to come through the white onto the cup. There we go, so she's going to start pouring it from the top and I'm gonna rotate it and we need to hold this too so it might be even easier to do it with three but anyway so she's being very nice and helping me and I'm holding the ice cream machine and rotating the wheel and it's supposed to come out as ice cream because the beaker is very very cold it's frozen um, but I don't see it coming out as ice cream 
No, no, my friend doesn't either. Hmm. Yeah, it stays kind of liquidy. It's the same. It's not changing its consistency or anything. Hmm. Yeah, no, this looks like pudding. Yeah, right. Hmm. I don't know why it's not working. Hmm. Okay, let's hold this together. Hold it tight. No, but it's still not coming out as ice cream. Oh, this is really disappointing. Okay, let's put more. Mm -mm, nope. No idea why it's not working. Hmm. Yeah, it's very weird. I don't know what's wrong or... Mm, I have no idea. But it definitely doesn't look like ice cream. So here is our pudding. And I'm gonna put some chocolate chips on the top. Oh, I think the chocolate is too big for it to, to go through correctly. So I'm just gonna open it and put some sprinkles. And there we go. I mean, it looks very good, yeah, but it doesn't look like ice cream, so let's try it because it looks really yummy, so let's see. Yeah, my friend has a big spoon, I have the small one, but we're both gonna try it. Uh, let's see. Mm. It is really good, but it doesn't have the ice cream consistency at all. Yeah, and look at that, it has some um, gelatin or it looks very like, like a gel. But it's definitely really good and in the bottom it's more liquid than the top. Mm -hmm. But the flavor is really good. The only thing is that it really doesn't look like ice cream, it's not frozen. I mean it's cold, but it's not frozen enough. Hmm, definitely looks like a pudding, but let's try the second one. Yeah, so we tried it the second time and nope, it is even more liquid. Didn't work and that's such a shame. I really thought that it was gonna work and that we were gonna have ice cream. I mean, the flavor is awesome, but the consistency is not what I was expecting. Anyway, does any of you have this ice cream machine? Do you know any tips? Or do you happen to know what we're doing wrong? You can write it in the comments below and let us all know, please. Anyway, I was very excited about this ice cream machine from Frozen with Anna and Elsa on it. But unfortunately, the ice cream doesn't come out as ice cream. It's more like a pudding, it's really good, but I was expecting ice cream, so please write it in the comments below if you know how to fix this. Thank you for watching Play With Me Toys For Your Kids. I hope you like this video. If you would like to watch more, please visit my channel and subscribe for free and be the first one to know when new videos are posted. Share this video with your friends and see you next time!